LAPD officers say the suspects are posting video of the dangerous incidents as part of a social media trend. CBS 2's Candace Crone spoke with a victim who was traumatized by the attack. Video posted to YouTube shows innocent bystanders ambushed by someone firing a paintball gun, then laughing as they're left in pain. The LAPD says they're seeing more and more crimes and videos just like this as part of a disturbing social media trend called paintball wars. So far this year, there's been 90 paintball gun shootings in the city, the majority in South LA. Investigators say the victims were simply out and about in their neighborhood, just like Ashton Lewis, when she was shot right in front of her friend last week. He just draws out um, a gun, and I didn't know it was a paintball gun. So I'm thinking, like, oh, my God, he's going to shoot us, and he just starts firing. So I didn't even know I was hit with a paintball gun. I thought I was shot, so I literally thought I was going to die. Officers say paintball gun shootings aren't a new problem, but they have increased more than 30% compared to last year. Police have arrested several suspects, many of them in their teens and early 20s. Authorities say they're not only concerned about the public safety, but also fear. An officer will encounter a young person armed with one of these realistic looking paintball guns and be forced to make a split second life and death decision. The LAPD says fortunately they haven't had any close calls like that, but they have noticed paintball guns now being sold out of ice cream trucks, making them easier for young people to get their hands on. Officers want to remind people that paintball guns should only be used in a controlled recreational environment with proper safety gear and willing participants. Police made eight arrests in just the last week alone. Shooting someone with a paintball gun is considered felony assault. In South LA, Candace Crone, CBS 2 News.